it still works. So can we view both at the same time? All right, look at that. So I have it on my phone and on the baby time, baby monitor screen. We are able to view from both devices at one time. It has been quite some time since I have did a product review video on a baby monitor, but the folks at baby time reached out to me with this baby monitor. Now normally these baby monitors only work on this little tablet, but this one actually has both, as you can see, monitor connection and app connection. So with this one, you could use the monitor maybe when you're sitting in your bedroom, and if you're away from the house and you wanna check in, you can use the app and still check in. I think that's great. I have not seen another baby monitor with this feature yet. Granted, I'm not looking that hard, but I think that's a really great feature that a lot of people will enjoy. So we're gonna get on the overhead rig, unbox this thing, get it set up on the Wi-Fi, test it on the app, test it on the monitor, and uh, show you exactly how it works. So click like, click subscribe, and indulge in your life at Indulge Clothing for the merch. Let's check out the Baby Time Baby Monitor. All right, baby monitor from baby time. As you see, it kind of looks like a cat, which is pretty cool. Supports monitor connection and app connection. I think that is the best feature of this. Nothing on the top, nothing uh, on the sides. The back shows you how you can mount it. You can either use the screws and mount it upside down, and then you invert the picture, or uh, you can just place it on a flat surface. And then here's your uh, manuals on the App Store and Google Play Store. It does only support 2.4 gigahertz, which is fine. I guess this is the bottom. Five inch color display, 1080p camera, full HD, infrared night vision, pry detection, temperature and humidity, feeding reminder, nursery rhymes, app connection, two way talk, one touch calling, zoom, and video encryption so you know you're safe. So let's, uh, let's get into this. I haven't did a baby monitor in like a year. I think the last one I got was actually last January. Now we'll just slide this out. Baby time on the box. Oh, and it's one of those. So we lift up. All right, so quick start guide right on top. A couple different languages. And then the camera. It's actually, uh, this part's soft and rubbery. And a little baby time logo there. There is an SD card slot right here at the top. Very nice. And there's the uh, mount, micro USB port on the back, and the speaker. That is the camera. Well, there's speakers here too. So one speaker may be for like two way communication, one speaker may be for like the nursery rhymes. I'm not certain, but there's two speakers here and a speaker here, it looks like. Let's look at this tablet. Ooh, man. Very nice looking micro SD card on the tablet and uh, your micro USB port. Got a little stand, little antenna, and uh, wow, it feels very, very nice quality. All right. Then two micro USB cables for this, one for this. This is that little mount that you can drill into the wall and then uh, goes into here. Two uh, USB bricks and our screws. All right, so that's essentially it for the Baby Time Baby Monitor unboxing. Now um, I'm gonna get this cleaned up and then we will get these, I'm gonna get this charged up and we'll get everything connected and get on the app and show you how all of that works. All right, so we're gonna get everything plugged up, starting first with the actual camera. This USB cable goes just above my head, so I would say it's about six and a half uh, feet, maybe close to seven feet. We'll plug in here on the back, and then we'll plug the other end here, and then we'll plug this into a power outlet. All right, that's got power. Let's give this some power. We've got a red light on the front here now. This cable seems to be the same length, no difference in the cables from what I can see. Oh, all right, plug in on this side, and we will peel this on off. And then same here, and plug into your power outlet. And there we go, both devices are plugged up. Let's put out our kickstand here. Look at that, got a nice little charging indicator. Now we need to go through the setup process. All right, so on our camera here, we have a steady flashing light. Peel this on off. Now we've got our tablet. Got a power button here on top. We're gonna hold that power button. It should power on this tablet and then prompt us 
to connect this. Maybe it needs more time to charge. Unplug the charge. So it's already uh, set up. How do I? Right, I've got a memory card here, got an antenna here. Let me go back into it. So it's already synced to this device. I didn't have to do anything. As you can see, when I press the buttons, it turns the camera. Look left, look right. We can even look up. Hello. <laughs> Very cool. Now if we go into menu here, so there's our, our mutus. We can turn the brightness up a little brighter. There's where we can take a picture. Oh, you need the SD card for a picture, okay. Same for a video, and then this is the playback. So since there's no SD card, there's no playback. Wallpaper, reset, device information, camera management. Got a nice back button here. Feeding reminders, you can set uh, feeding reminders. Amenity detection, so it'll tell you uh, if it gets to a certain degree. Smart care, motion detection, noise detection, cry detection, alarm volume. That's SD card management, sleep mode, date and time, indicator light. Wow, you can turn off the indicator light, the little blue light on the front. And then language wallpaper reset, device information. Now this one I thought said, hello. So there's the feed, that looks pretty nice. Now we're gonna go through um, the setup process with our phone. So you're gonna get kind of two angles here. So I'm gonna go into my Play Store, search Cloud Edge. All right, make us an account. All right, so now that I've downloaded the Cloud Edge app and created my account, I can add a device and I'm going to select Baby Camera, Baby Camera Wi-Fi, place power on the device, okay. connection. Okay, all right, so it wants me to hold the reset button on this device for four to five seconds, which is right here underneath the chin. So, um, all right, I think I found something small enough to use. Go down in here. All right, it's flashing blue. Wait for a flashing red indicator light. I got flashing blue, so we're gonna say next anyway. Put in our Wi-Fi password, and then we're gonna show this camera the QR code. Scan the QR code. I heard the tone, and so now this camera should be connecting to my Wi-Fi network where I could view it through this app. As you can see, we got a blue light now, and there is our device. Hey, hello. That's a really nice picture. Look at that. Current place is good. Good signal strength. We'll name it Baby's Room. Now if I want to view it, I can click right into it. Got an intercom option. Have my phone muted, by the way. Screenshots, humidity, PTZ, and tilt and zoom. So that's how you can move it around. Very nice. You can see my Wi-Fi signal's 89%. Calendars. Now let's look at one other thing. I want to see. I want to see what does this do now. Look at that. It still works. So can we view both at the same time? Look at that. We can. All right, look at that. So I have it on my phone and on the baby time, baby monitor screen. We are able to view from both devices at one time. If we slap some memory cards in here, we should be good to go. So this is an audio video test on the baby time, baby monitor. A night video test on the baby time monitor. And that should essentially do it for the baby time, baby monitor. That is the setup process. As you can see out of the box, this worked right away. I then used the bobby pin, reset the camera to get it flashing red, and was able to get it to connect to the Cloud Edge app. And as you can see in my video, somebody could be at the house using this device while you're away from the house using the Cloud Edge app to also view the baby monitor. So personally, I think this is an amazing, amazing baby monitor with tons of features with the feeding reminders and the tones and all of that kind of stuff. I would definitely highly recommend this. I will of course have one of these linked down below in the description if you'd like to grab one for yourself. And I think that will do it for today's video. Click that like button, click subscribe, indulge in your life at Indulge Clothing for the merch, and I'll see you in the next one. Deuces.